Yo, what is up guys and welcome back to another episode of Slice of Shonen. I am your host, The Cloudy Chrome. Today, we'll be reacting to the 100 Girlfriends That Really, 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 Really Love You Episode 7. And in this episode, this is going to be a big, big episode, I'm sure, because here we are going to be meeting the fifth and final girlfriend. Now, I've been reading the comments and I've seen some of you guys say that there might be another sixth one that they might squeeze into this season before it ends. So I'm I'm looking forward to that as well but this one specifically I'm looking forward to because many of you guys have said that the series is gonna get a lot more interesting after she enters the harem and hopefully after this episode I'll know why you guys have all said that but there's only one way to find out so if you guys are excited for the episode make sure to leave a like and while you're down there make sure to hit that subscribe button and lastly do not forget that over on the patreon there are a bunch of bonuses the main one being that if you head on over and join the two dollar tier then you get access to all of my uncut reactions, including this series right here. But with that all out of the way, let's get into this episode. Dang, they're already dropping us right into the middle of this. And everybody's here too. Oh, this is the new girl. Yep, she's already over here cooking. And look at that. Look, they didn't even like have a real like confrontation he's just running past her in the hallway and he already like locked eyes with her and she's already this is her no nah, no nah, there's gotta be a mix-up because look in the opening even right here we see her and she looks nothing like that is this like her sister or something i, I guess she does kind of i don't know why i always thought she was shorter the chemistry lab. Why is everybody wearing slides at this school? Do they not have, like, school shoes? Or are they allowed to wear those here? Yeah! What the heck?! Okay, so maybe there's, like, two girls here. And that was, like, her sister we met yesterday. Rantara, what's her name? Kusuri! Don't trust it, Rentaro. Do not trust it. You meet someone for the first time and the first thing they do is give you some randomly concocted drug? Alright, let's see. Is it gonna make him go bald or something? Is it actually good? Dude, what's with, like, you know, scientists and science teachers in anime using, like, beakers and Bunsen burners to, like, make coffee and tea? We're getting a science lesson here. What? So you become a giant magnet, basically. What is the practical use of this? Why would you want to become a giant magnet? That just sounds inconvenient. And how the heck did she get the S and the N in there? <laughs> Wait, why are they censoring math? They are saying math, right? Okay. Not too bad. I don't know why there's just giant nails lying around. And a spoon. <laughs> oh, of course. You gotta have the disclaimer for the side effects. Oh, you two are, like, magnetically attracted to each other. <laughs> That's adorable. Dude, that is so adorable. Yeah. That hair is crazy, by the way. Whoa! <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Let's calm down a bit there. We just learned your name like five minutes ago. Oh my god. <laughs> and now they can't separate. <laughs> this is a disaster. Always oh, wear diapers. <laughs> no way. No, what is this imagery? <laughs> 
Get me out, dude. Get me out. Get me out of this anime. Dude, this episode is already nuts. Ventriloquism medicine. Night vision. Night vision's kind of cool. So, okay. My guess is that was her that we saw. Yeah, exactly. That was her we saw yesterday. She must have just used some crazy potion. Some, some growth serum. Oh no. Oh, love potion. <laughs> oh my gosh. <laughs> oh no, she's not gonna like that. That's true. That is a good point. Trying to throw up the love potion. Why? Does he want it to be natural? I love the how there's just sounds of him like struggling in the background. Ah, oh, look what you did, Rentaro. You're gonna have to fix this. Yeah, yeah. He wanted to. He wanted it to be genuine. What the heck? Is this man phasing into another dimension? Oh my god. <laughs> what? This man turned into Michael Jackson. <laughs> There's some sort of demon inside of him. She has to cure him. First kiss. Dang, she works quick. That was a wild convulsion back there. <laughs> he became like 20 different people in 20 seconds. Yeah, so she knows it's real now. Dang! Oh my god, she's turning a little too red. Is this another side effect? <laughs> yeah, you don't need to bow and beg him. Dude, I like Kusuri, man. Oh, here it is! The transformation! Is she like a werewolf? But at night she grows up or something? Dang. Yep, this is her. Her voice changes too? The neutralizer that stopped him also affected her. So this is her normally. Okay, I thought the other one was her normal form. Actually a third year, of course. <laughs> so she's even older than him. Dang. <laughs> I don't know, man. Kusuri? The other girls are alright, but Kusuri? Man, Taro's losing it. And now look at how the tables have turned. Uno reverse. Nah, Rentaro bagged him a baddie this time, I'm not gonna lie. <laughs> change diapers! What a way to ruin the moment, dude. Oh, I forgot to change my diaper. Okay, that's not a good way to introduce yourself. <laughs> look at that dumb look on her face. <laughs> Smile with a thumbs up. No? She's gonna take it. <laughs> or maybe not. Untwistify. Feminine? <laughs> okay, she's just roasting her at this point. Rantara, so you gotta keep that mouth shut, buddy. There you go. Nice save. <laughs> Hot stuff medicine? What does that do? You just drink it and it happens? Okay- OH MY CAMERAMAN! <laughs> I'm banned. I'm banned. Alright, I'm banned. Goodbye YouTube, it's over. I feel like this is gonna end terribly though. What? Oh no, she's transforming. OH! NO! Dude, my channel. <laughs> it's so gone. 
It's gonna be wiped off the face of the internet after this. Nice save, Rentaro. Saving you and me both there, brother. Oh my god. Classic. Classic Akari. <laughs> Alright, now what we got for Shizuka? Hopefully something much more tame than that. Oh, of course. Funny girl. See, it's such a subtle touch! But it's nice! There's definitely gonna be, like, an adorable competition between her and Kusuri. Aw, oh, man. <laughs> Wholesome. And last but not least, hair control medicine! Okay, that's kinda cool. And look at the other girls just petting Shizuka. I mean, that's kinda cool. Hers, like, hers has a pretty cool, like, practical use. There you go. <laughs> she prepared so much. Increases the risk of going bald. I knew there was gonna be a bald side effect in one of these potions. That's one way to look at it. We gotta see it now. Look at that! We gotta see it. Bald Nano. That is when this series will truly hit peak. I see what everyone means now. Kusuri is nuts. She's like the chaotic element of this entire group here. Which was already chaotic to begin with. Just because of all of these clashing personalities. Okay, that's cool. So she's got a dream. Oh, here we go again. <laughs> Please! And the thing is, like, last time it makes sense, because she didn't have any options. She was, like, glued to him. But this time she could literally just walk to the bathroom. Hmm? <laughs> oh my god. No, oh, no, this isn't good. No way. This is gonna end terribly. Oh, I guess it wasn't that bad. Okay. I thought they were gonna mix it up. Oh, no. They did mix it up. Oh, my God. Oh, they thought the small one was for him. Oh, what has she done? Hurry up and blurg! Okay, and what about the other one? Oh, so this is gonna... This is gonna... Is this gonna reverse? Onto Rentaro? See, she has to realize. She doesn't need to drug him. Oh no. Here the rivalry begins! <laughs> God, where'd she get this hellfire from? <laughs> she's dead. Oh, she's the only one that didn't drink it, that's why. <laughs> they turned into zombies. You gotta make an antidote now. So she scared everyone away from the chem club. Dang, did, like, super strength come as a part of that? Or is Hikari just built different? <laughs> Bump ugly. <laughs> oh my god, this anime is too good. Dang, this music is hype! Superhuman strength. Their brain doesn't limit them. This sounds terrifying. Nah, man, this sounds like it's gonna be a lot more dangerous than that. Like them sucking your face off or something. Like aliens. Alright. They're making their move. Is it over? 
No way! That went by so fast, dude. What a cool... I, I accept it, though. I think that's a cool way to end it. All right, so that was the end of the episode, and my question of the day for you guys is going to be, what is your first impression of Kusuri? Or if you've read the manga, what was your first impression of her? For me, I love her already, man. I think it's not too crazy to say that she's already my favorite character. I always tend to gravitate towards the more chaotic characters in anime, and she is definitely that character in this series, dude. Ever since she was first revealed in the anime, things just started blowing up in our faces. And I love it. This entire episode was so good. This, I don't know, last episode was definitely my favorite, but I think this one is a close second, dude. This is a really, really close second. And it's only the introductory episode to Kusuri. So let me know what you guys think in the comment section down below. And with that, I'm going to head out. Thank you all so much for watching this far into the video. And I will catch you all in the next one. Have a good one.